Hey, what's up, y'all? Your boy Domino7 is here. Okay. I want to talk about Jeopardy. I haven't talked about Jeopardy in a long time. Okay. So, you know what, y'all? A lot of people been complaining about uh, uh, them them not, not having regular episodes of Jeopardy, you know, with, with regular games and stuff, and all these tournaments and stuff like that, you know. But, you know, honestly, I really enjoyed today's episode, you know, with Alan Lynn, Matt Jackson, and Terry O'Shea, okay? So this was the 9,000th episode of Jeopardy, okay? Yeah. <laughs> All right, so, I mean, it, it, it was so much fun watching uh, Jeopardy, you know? And, you know, I think uh, uh, the, the, the Will of Fortune uh, 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 had, had his 9,000th episode, too, you know? But for some reason, I missed that, you know? So, anyway... It's not about Wheel of Fortune, it's about Jeopardy, okay? So, if I've done a video talking about the 9,000 episode of The Price is Right, I can definitely talk about uh, Jeopardy, okay? Yeah, so, I must say, I really enjoyed today's show, and um, and, and what I want to say, uh, Johnny Gilbert been on every episode of Jeopardy, all 9,000 episodes, you know? And he in his nineties, you know, and uh, he kind of y- younger than uh, excuse my stuttering. He kind of younger than Bob Barker, you know, and I'm pretty sure uh, uh, Johnny Gilbert met Bob Barker, you know. I wonder how it would have been if he would have announced the Price Is Right, filling in for Rod Roddy or anybody, you know. Okay, how he would have said, "Come on down," you know. I sure wish I could have heard uh, uh, Johnny Gilbert say, "Come on down." You know, well, this is Jeopardy, not the price is right, you know. Okay, so I kind of wish Alex Trebek would have still been here, but uh, Alex Trebek would have would have retired by then. Just like Bob Barker didn't didn't, didn't make it to, to episode 9,000, 9, but, but uh, uh, Johnny Gilbert didn't either. You know, Bob Barker didn't didn't, didn't make it to to the nine thousand episode of The Price Is Right, and and um, and Alex Trebek wouldn't have either. You know, to for for the nine thousand episode of Jeopardy. You know, okay, so so yeah, these these, these game shows been around for a long time, so these game shows ain't going nowhere. You know, The Price Is Right ain't going nowhere. Jeopardy ain't going nowhere. Will of Fortune ain't going nowhere. You know, mm hmm. Yeah, people enjoy these game shows, okay? And Jeopardy, I mean, Matt Jackson is awesome, you know. I like these these, these invitation tournaments, you know. I mean, bringing people back from the from the Alex Trebek era, and and, and yesterday I seen my other favorite uh, Jeopardy player, uh, Jason Zuffernary. I call him the the at first I call him the uh, James Hosow replacement. Okay, to me, Jason Zuffernary was was a uh, a uh, Jason uh, uh, not Jason. I mean, Jason Zuffernary is is James Hosshaw's replacement until Madame Audio came along, and then until Amy Schneider came around. You know, uh huh. Yep. So I like these Jeopardy players. You know. Okay. So all I'm saying about Amy Schneider, if Alex Trebek would have still been alive, he would have. He, he would have uh, been so proud of y'all, you know. Season 38 would have been Alex Trebek's last season, you know, and he would have retired by then, you know. Yep, so I must say Alex Trebek is so happy uh, uh, to, to to smile out on Jeopardy. I like these in, in the, the, these tournaments, but I want to see Natalie Lips come back, you know, Dylan Parsons to come back, you know. Well, what about Michael Baker, you know? And Laura Ashby, you know, I sure would like for, for, for her to come back, even though uh, I, I do apologize to Laura Ashby for, for, for mocking her with, uh, with, 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 when, she, when she did that accent, you know, you know, when, when she said 600 and all that. But I, I apologize to, to Laura Ashby after all these years. So if, if what I say was offensive a long time ago, I apologize, you know. Okay, I apologize to Laura Ashby, but I like Laura Ashby. 
I still wish she, she could come back to Jeopardy, okay? Uh-huh. So I'm glad to have Matt Jackson back and Alan Lynn, okay? And Terry O'Shea. I wonder who going to be back Monday, okay? So I want to say about this tournament, will Amy Schneider and, and Andrew He have another rematch? So will Andrew He get his rematch on Amy Schneider? We'll have to see about that, you know, because Ken Jennings already got his his rematch on on uh Brad Rutter, you know. But three times he got defeated by uh three times, yeah, three times he been defeated by uh uh uh, uh by Brad Rutter, you know. Okay. So I'm I'm talking about Ken Jennings, you know. Okay. The ultimate tournament of champions, the uh uh battle of the decades, and then the uh uh all star tournament, you know. Mm-hmm. So I I if, if Julia Collins ain't coming back, it, it, if that news is true, I'm surprised Julia Collins ain't coming back. Sandy Baker should come back too, you know. Andrew Powell should come back. Andrew Her- Herringer, you know, and Scott Lennon, you know, Len- Len- Lennon, uh, you, you you know that the, the the guy that defeated Greg Greg Soroka in regular games in season thirty one, you know, have Choyon to come back, you know. I Choyon should come back, and uh uh Dan. Uh, I'm a I, I'm a find out Dan's uh, uh, last name. He from season uh, thirty one, okay. I and uh, bring back uh, Elliot Yates, you know. Yep, bring back a lot of the Jeopardy past players, you know, from the Alex Trebek era, you know. After all these years, and Karen Mornaka, she 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 was on Jeopardy with Alex Trebek, you know. And and I heard she was on an Art Fleming uh, a, a version of of Jeopardy, you know, and she got defeated by by, by, by Brian Arson, Aronson or uh, whatever whatever his name is, you know. So, so yeah, though, you know, so, so 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 anyway, they 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 should bring them back, you know, okay. A lot of people they 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 should bring back, especially Natalie Lips, you know, Rainy Peffer, yeah. I sure wish they did they'll bring her back too, cause she's she, she was my Jeopardy my favorite Jeopardy player as well. Okay. Alright, so I, I really enjoyed uh uh, uh uh this episode of Jeopardy. Hey, you know what? I'm surprised uh uh, uh Matt Jackson didn't did not pound his fist l- like he did saying boom, you know, when when he made that that, that true daily double and risked twelve thousand on 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 that on that clue on a daily double, you know. Yeah, I, I'm I'm kind of surprised he didn't pound his fist. You know, let me let, let me put my camera down and show y'all what I mean. I'm surprised he didn't go boom. I I I'm surprised, Matt Jackson. If you're watching this, I'm surprised you didn't do that. You better do it next time in the semifinals if you if you get that far. Okay, will Alex Jacob come back? Who knows? I wish Alex Coral would would come back. You know. The guy, the guy that defeated uh, Stephen Grade, and uh, and got defeated by by James Holzhauer, you know. So, I sure wish Alex Coral would come back, you know. That that that'll be great if he come back, you know. All right, so that's all I gotta say, and, and I hope y'all enjoyed uh, Jeopardy's nine thousand episode. Okay, all right, thank y'all for watching. All right, bye bye.